Grown man business. Right, I've got another episode of Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. We're going to do some NBA talk right now. Um, yeah, Mr. T with the bees, baby. All right, anyway, I've got some breaking news, man. Uh, Blake Griffin, he broke his uh, shooting hand, his right hand, from punching the equipment guy, his friend, actually. Uh, they was in Toronto in a in a restaurant, started arguing, and they went outside, and started fighting. Um, Blake Griffin was on top of him, hit him a few times actually, and ended up breaking his hand. So he's gonna be out four to six weeks. Doc Rivers believe that's that's uh it's not gonna take that long. Uh, maybe maybe a, a month, not six weeks. Uh, Blake Griffin was already injured and been missing a couple games anyway. But it looks like he's going to be out a little longer. It's crazy, man. But um, they 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 giving him a lot of backlash behind this. Um, the, him and the equipment guy, they started with the Clippers at the same time. So they, they grew to be pretty good friends. And I, they was having a heated discussion in the restaurant. And uh, one thing led to, to another. They just ended up going outside and and fighting it out like men, I guess. Um don't look good for the NBA, don't look good for the Clippers, and it definitely don't look good for Blake Griffin. Um, I mean, the equipment guy, you know, whatever his salary is, it's not compared to Blake Griffin. He got to be smarter. He got so many endorsements with these commercials and the, uh, the car and all that stuff. Um, and he's a funny guy, man. He got, I think I see a good career with him acting in the future. So he got to be, he got to be careful. All right, we're going to talk about uh, my boy, Demarcus Cousins. Boogie. Uh, they still talking about trading him. Um, it would be stupid, man. The other night, he scored 56 points, which was a uh, um, Sacramento record for most points. That was that was a Sacramento Kings record right there. So he's a good player, man. I, I would love to see him with my boys, the Nets. Or even a, a more valuable team, because the Nets got some time to grow. It's gonna be a while before they 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 even be in the conversation of playoffs or anything. But I can see him with the Knicks. I can see him with uh, I can see him with LeBron James. You know they need an extra big guy, especially like him, an attitude like him. You know he's nasty with it. Uh, yeah, he'll be a good fo- a fit in Cleveland. I can see him with the uh, Golden State Warriors. <laughs> oh my God. We're going to talk about Golden State Warriors next, too. I'm going to leave this video alone right now, man. We're going to talk about Blake Griffin. He broke his hand, his right hand, just a bone, and his uh, ring finger. And uh, He's going to be out for four to six weeks. Uh, Boogie, DeMarcus Cousins, they still giving him a lot of problems. Um, back and forth talk with trading him or keeping him. They, they kind of placing him or labeling him under – uh, a bully type thing, man. You know, he, he he got a bad attitude. Don't get along with the coaches, some of the players. Almost like uh, Ron Artest. You know, uh, Ron Artest, you know, he started out in uh, Sacramento also. And he's pretty much going the same route, man. Can you see Boogie in, in L.A. with the Lakers? Oh, my God. All right. That's some NBA talk, man. Give me your opinion. Let me know what y'all think about Blake Griffin. Um should he be traded? They talking about he might be traded now behind that. I don't think he should be traded. Just discipline. He's already going to be out. So it is what it is. It happened. He made a mistake. Hopefully he learned from it. He been doing uh, some crazy things this year. So he needs to sit tight, man. Get back to being that, that good uh, reputation, Blake. And what you think about uh, Boogie, man, DeMarcus Cousins? Should he stay in Sacramento? Uh, should they just leave him alone? Should they trade him? I think they should go ahead and trade him because I'm tired of them talking about it. You know, I'm tired of Sacramento giving him a lot of slack, man. He, nobody's defending this guy. And he's a good player. So give me what you think. Give me, give me your opinion. Tell me what you think. And uh, we're doing some NBA talk, baby. Grown man business.